Can y'all hear me now? <laughs> they can hear me now. All right, cool. Discord. I, I love you. Love you, love you, love you, Discord. Mm. But how about that trailer? To those of y'all that don't spoil it for anybody in here, please do not. Uh, but for those for those of y'all that did, uh, just how hyped are you? Because I know I am. Nope, oh, there are IMAX streams. Probably. Uh, I know I plan on. I have, I have a couple friends of mine over here that I'm planning on seeing um, the movie day of. Um, everybody else seems to everybody else seems to agree that it's that it's hyped. Yeah, and what I plan is watching the first two movies for seeing. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Get you in, get you in the mood. Get you like in the perfect heads. You 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 get what I mean. Uh, the point is, I feel you. Uh, got Paramount Plus already on my end. Got logins from my mom because I'm broke, so that helps. December is my B-Day month. Oh, well, happy hella early birthday. Um, I'm just not a movie guy. I mean, I, I would, I mean, that's, I mean, that's, that's all you, <laughs> no offense. Uh, yeah, do, yeah, yeah, do what you do. Yeah, at the end of the day, do whatever makes you happy. Uh, and yeah, or what would I reaction to it? Uh, I mean, I don't know if I can think of anyone outside of Twitter that would have an issue with Keanu Reeves, with Keanu Reeves, uh, uh, pl- playing playing the anti-hero, uh, badass for lack of better terms. <laughs> he'd probably satisfy. Yeah, he'd probably be up here talking about it's the ultimate movie <laughs> or something like that. The casting choice for Shadow was amazing. Yeah, Keanu Reeves is per is Keanu Reeves as Shadow is like the most perfect casting choice of all time. I'm a die on that hill. Like if we couldn't get Kirk Thornton, if we couldn't get if we couldn't get Jason uh, I, or David, like I, or Ian, I would like that was my first choice. Indeed, is a national treasure. Yes, absolutely. Um, from what I hear, quite possibly the nicest guy in Hollywood. So <laughs> that is also that is a positive. <laughs> Some people wanted Robert Pattinson for Shadow. I mean, you know what? That wouldn't be. I mean, I wouldn't mind that either. Um, there were some people that mentioned it for Hayden Christensen as well, which I mean. Which which would have been which would have been dope because I would have given an opportunity to do something besides that to have a role people know him for besides Star Wars was good nerds uh, I'm doing good I'm nerds I mean, I am nerds that's a I I am that is a sentence I just said yeah <laughs> nerds in a Sonic server no way that's crazy <laughs> I'm Khaled I'm Khaled, I'm good. Good to see you, Ja. I mean, Mr. Nerds. <laughs> Mr. Hodgson, actually. But uh, thank you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hope you all having a great whatever time of day it is. Uh, yeah, because uh, you're in. Yeah, because you're in. Um, if you don't mind me, yeah, you don't. If you don't mind me asking, you're in Palestine, right? So I'll, yeah, I'll imagine it's a good few hours ahead. It's like 6 p.m. over here. <laughs> I'm just making the guess because I don't think you might have told me that before, but I can't remember. <laughs> don't mean to put you on the spot, my bad. Uh, so, Kevin, <clears throat> what to do, Mr. Pickle? Uh, there we go. It, it's coming. <laughs> okay, I believe the uh, our panelists should be here in about five minutes. What's up, Pinky? Uh, bye, Pinky. Uh, I saw you for two seconds and you dipped. Uh, but it's okay. We got we got that on Craig bot. Uh, <laughs> Chat and four. Oh, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> uh, infectious pink vo. They do a very great. They do a very great voice of um of uh vanilla of uh, vanilla and marine. <sighs> Wait, why is this a pinky moment? I I mean I don't know. Uh, but but I just gave a whole wave of love center away. So uh, I guess mission accomplished. <laughs> First time I've seen one of the tea times. Well, there you go. I think you can go me in for a treat. That's for damn sure. We just did a bit for no reason. I didn't even mean for that to be a bit. I was just giving a sh- I was just giving it a shout out. Y'all, I mean, I mean, I guess, uh, I mean, listen, this is, I mean, I use my powers for good, I guess. So there's a, cause I just said, I just said it. Y'all don't want to do it. <laughs> All right. I just popped. Yep. There you are, Shane. <sighs> hey, uh, everyone's getting ready to, uh, get ready to go on this here. So give me, give us just a second. No problem. No problem. Just whenever, whenever we got every, whenever we got everybody set up, I can, I'll hop back in. I just need to make sure everyone else is good first. What's up, Sonic? Um, hey, what's up, Josh? I'm what's doing up, just, Nick? I'm doing just great. Yo, what's up, Remix? Yo, just, uh, 
We're just, I'm just waiting to do our little tea party tonight. I'm yeah. actually surprised you agreed to this. I'm, it, it's going to be fun. Yeah. I mean, I've never done one before. So it should be fun. There you go. There's our co host, Whispering VA. Yes. Whispering VA, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to stop talking because y'all, because everybody's up here and that's y'all's job. So I'm going to hop into the audience. The stage is all yours. <clears throat> Hello. Hey, what's up, Starline? Hello. For a second there, I thought you'd go with the meme greeting, but I'm glad you chose a different direction tonight. Yeah, why not? Oh, welcome, everyone. Uh, we're, this is another tea time with uh, Dr. Starline. And tonight uh, we got our, our special guest, uh, Sonic, here with us. Uh, as oh, I was just saying, I'm, this is Vinny. I'm so sorry for cutting you off, but this is such a long time coming. Mm. Yeah, I've heard so much about your tea time, so why not? I thought I'd give exactly. it a go. Exactly. Yes. You may continue now, Remix. I apologize. That's okay. Uh, as I was just saying, I was actually kind of surprised he, he decided to actually accept your invitation this time. Oh, I know. It took a, <laughs> a lot of convincing. Yeah, not that much. I thought I'd give it a go. Oh, excellent. Excellent. Uh, and then I got my co-host with me, Whispering VA. They're going to help me uh, uh, get some guests up here to uh, to ask y'all questions and hand out tea as always. Uh, yes. So then, um, are we ready to get ready to go on this? Indeed. Ready when you let's are. Do it. All right. Uh, so let's get some hands up here. Um, a little quiet tonight. Oh Ooh, come on! Don't be shy, I'm everybody. Poor. It's me we're talking about, and of course our number one mascot and savior of the world, Sonic the Hedgehog. Aw, oh, thanks, Starling. You're making me blush. Oh, it's nothing, my good sir. Come on, raise those hands. It's just me. There's nothing to worry about. Yeah, come on, raise those hands. Come on, guys, get get some more hands up. But I'm moving on to six. Interesting. Oh. All righty. Uh, Starlight, do you want to uh, cho choose the first um, guest? Yes, I would, actually. Let's see. A lot of familiar faces. Uh, oh, here's one I haven't seen before, actually. Uh, let's call up Volt here. Volt Asterite. Hello, Volt. Testing, testing. Everything coming through okay? Yep. Yes. Hello. Uh, what kind of tea would you like? I haven't Ooh, asked that uh, in ages. I need some lemon so tea with a dash of honey. I love that oh. stuff. Excellent choice. Excellent. I always recommend that after a good cold. Uh, uh, here you are. Now, what is your question, good sir? Uh, delicious. Thank you. And my question in was actually for Sonic. I Ooh, wanted to ask perfect. I wanted to ask, because of the whole Extreme Gear charity race event that's been going on recently, I wanted to ask. What actually got you into extreme gear racing in the first place, aside from spiting Jet? Ooh, well, drop. well, you know, I love racing. I love going fast. And when Tails showed me his, you know, extreme gear, I was like, I gotta try this thing. And I love snowboarding. Put it all together and you got yourself some cool stuff. So that's why. Uh, yeah, I do remember you taking multiple avalanches on a snowboard. Yeah. That was wild. But, uh, yeah. That's my question. Thank you so much for the tea. Oh, and I did leave a little tray of biscuits for you in order to enjoy. Anyway, Ooh. take care. Mm, Thank you so much. Mmm, mm, good biscuits. Mm. Oh, they sound tasty. And would you mm -hmm. like some remix? There's plenty for all of us. Oh, absolutely. Mm. Uh, and then I'll take a I'll take a strawberry uh, cream tea. Thank you. Mmm, you got me right up. <laughs> Oh, and can so you fix easy. up a peppermint tea for Griff? She's over here hmm. whining. Oh, of course, of course. Always make sure the pets are fed. You know what oh. I mean. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. Here you are. You wouldn't have Thank been you. black currant, would you? Oh, the what? Who would you take me for? A, a, a savage? Of course I have black currant. Mm. Here you are. Mm. Say, Sterling. Well, thank you. you have I, um, do you have a chili dog tea? Uh, uh, n no. Uh, why would you, you know what? No, 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 no. Such thing does not exist, Sonic. Why not? 
Because if you tried making a chili dog into a tea, it would not be a tea. It would be a sludge, and I do not drink sludge. What you need, my good friend, is something that matches your fiery spirit. Something that may put a little burnt on the tongue, but a fire in your soul. And there's you cannot go wrong with this cinnamon tea. Straight up just cinnamon. Yeah. Oh. Cinnamon oh, tea? Oh, it's not that bad. I promise you. It, it will not only exfoliate your taste buds, but it will clear your sinuses too. Mm. Come um, on. Um, Give it a try. Know. It smells like knuckles, man. I don't know. <laughs> knuckles smells like cinnamon? Yeah, quite often. I'm not even going to well, question it. Just try it. Him the benefit try of the it. Come on. <laughs> Uh, it's not like I'm going to poison you. It's out of my contract anyway. <laughs> Fair point. Okay, I'll give it a try. Hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Actually, it's 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 pretty good. Mm. Yeah, right? It's so good. Though it's better in the winter time. But I figured, mm. uh, regarding the dire circumstances, I was suddenly thrust into. It would be perfect for you. Hmm. You know what? You're right, man. You got me down to a T. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, yes. oh, oh, I see what you did there. <laughs> oh, 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 I see what you did there. Uh, next time, we should have you try, ooh, I don't know. You like pink things, don't you? Well, I do love some pink things. What if I uh, I kind of see you with Sh- I kind of see Sonic more as a black tea type person, maybe. Mm, yeah, I mean, I, yeah, I can go with black tea as well. I see what you're doing there, and I will not allow you to to, to infer such oh, things. Oh, uh, really? Oh, really? No, just... <laughs> you like you you, you say he was, like? I don't know what you're referring to. I was referring to. Oh, a I don't beautiful... know what you're referring to either. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I was referring to a, a beautiful peach mm, or rosé. Uh-huh. Why are you laughing? <laughs> I don't. I've never heard him laugh before. That that creeps me out. You sound you you sound like this uh, this fellow I know. It's kind of creepy. Oh, Bean. Oh, his name escapes me at the moment, but he's not important. Uh, shall we move on? Ah, uh, yeah. Let's choose somebody. I yeah, believe... I think something would be your turn. Yes, I was going oh, right. to agree. Um, ooh, I'm gonna choose prankster. Come on up. Hello, everybody. How are y'all doing today? Hey, prankster. Hey, hey, hey. Sonic, Starline, Whispering. So good to see you all in Remix. Of course, lovely to see you, too. Oh, I really wish the feeling was mutual. Uh, well, besides the point, I've got a question. As for you, what kind of What kind of... Wait, but what kind of tea would you like before you ask? Oh, right. Silly me. This is the tea time. <laughs> Duh. But an apple tea, actually. Hmm. Well, Ooh, actually, hold on. Nice. What, one second. Let me check something real quick. Oh, right. <laughs> I forgot. You're actually blacklisted from having any of my tea. All right. It's, All right. I have, a, I, I have a list, and it says here, <laughs> crimes <laughs> against the, the tea society <laughs> for microwaving water in microwave before... <laughs> Constructing <laughs> slime. <laughs> You're welcome to have a biscuit, oh, but unfortunately, no tea. As a as a as a as a high ranking member of the tea society of the world, I'm afraid I have to buy you from enjoying these. Uh, Does that mean you have to ban Ladise too? <laughs> I would, but she's my boss, and she would fire me for doing so. My hands are kind of tied here. <laughs> okay, well, all right. all right, I'll live with it. I'll Besides, with it. she think... can plead ignorance, so she gets a pass. Oh, oh. Well, I can. Just I mean my... that in the most positive way. It's not always a bad thing to be ignorant. It just, it means an opportunity to to, to, to learn. learn. Yes, exactly. Please ask the question <laughs> and we can move on. <laughs> uh, Arline, um, I was actually going to ask out of pure curiosity, has there been any missions 
where you had to distract somebody? So how did you do it? Ooh. Mm. That's a good question, oh. Starlight. Hmm. Oh, well, there's this really funny story um, where there was this one time I had a... Uh, I had stolen a car, actually, um, a really nice uh, uh, Rolls Royce. Uh, it was vintage. Oh. It was like from the from the seventies, actually. I was very oh. shocked, and so I I'd stolen it from somebody because um, I was teaching Serge how to break into uh, into a car because that's a a trick you might want if you suddenly cannot go fast with your legs. You might steal a car and get away that way. Anyway, so I, I, and also it was a really expensive Rolls Royce. Anyway, so I, I, I'm over there and I'm driving it around and, and we're on a mission where we have to retrieve a little bit more intel for one of the egg bases. So I'm there and, um, and so I'm all dressed up and then this really, really fancy gentleman stops me and he mistakes me for a valet. Um, and at first I was like, I'm not the valet. I, I'm, uh, I'm just, um, I, I'm just here watching my kids. Uh, at least that was what I tried to say. But then he, he was going to walk in and, and see Surgeon Kit working on getting information. So I, I had to stop and be like, oh, but it, actually on, on second thought, I, I could uh, perhaps drive you to your location wherever you need to go. I was in that car for an hour and a half, driving this gentleman halfway across the city, in traffic, and then all the way back. And by the time I got him back, there was Serge and Kit and Serge over there with her pouty face and tapping her foot, being like, Oh, hey, what took you so long, Doc, huh? And I'm over here like, you would not believe the day I had. But I did get a $150 tip out of it. So, I mean, oh. it worked out pretty well. Um, but... Oh, Sorry, it was 175. My bad. It was a little more oh. than I thought. Um, so yes, but after that, they were they were like, "Oh, did we get ice cream now?" I'm like, no, Daddy's tired. He's going to go home and soak his feet. And that's exactly what I did when I got back. <laughs> oh well. Wow. So you became an Uber driver. Personally, 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 actually, I. I, um, I, I'm more akin to Lyft, actually, not Uber. So I, I, was okay. gonna say, I was going to say, I thought the okay, correct sure. term was chauffeur, but sure. Yes, I became a chauffeur for the day. Though, I guess Lyft and Uber drivers are a type of chauffeur. Also, uh, Mr. Joshua Hodgson, uh, I'm shocked you don't make $175 in a day. You should get a Rolls Royce or steal it and just drive fancy <laughs> people around. <laughs> I'm sure you could make a lot more than me in a day than I did in an hour and a half. Well, tell me the only way I would minutes. make that much in a day is if it's a holiday and it's raining. Oh, well, chill oh, up, Remix. Saturday. Christmas is around the corner. It'll be here before you, mm -hmm. before you know it. In. And with it comes the back to sh school shopping and with the Halloween and the costumes and the panicking and the... Uh... Anyways, Everything. Yes, well, yes, well, thank you for your question, Prankster. It was lovely seeing you again. And it's lovely to see you too. Toodle See you around. Oh, I can breathe now. Oh, gosh. Do Josh is like, Star uh, Starline, you can get free health care in prison. Uh, well... They haven't, listen, they haven't caught me. They haven't, they, they don't even, the dude has like, I, the guy I stole from has like, I don't know, 50 cars in his garage? He's not going to miss a 1970-something Rolls Royce that's probably worth more than, than uh, Eggman makes in a year. That's not true. He probably mm. makes a little more than that. Okay, but my point is he's not going to miss it. He's got like 50, 49 other cars to drive around. Or to look at, or to to spit on. I don't know what you do with fancy cars. I like driving mine around. Of course, it wears down the value because of depreciation. But it's a nice car to drive in. Leather seats and oh, the uh, the it, it's got it, it's. It, I I, I mm, you just have to get one and drive it for yourself. That's all I say. Mm. All right. Uh, whispering VA, would you like to choose the next? Uh. Yes. Sure. Let's see. Who do we have? All right. Here's a face I haven't seen before. Or maybe I have. Let's see. Let's just bring up 
Emerald Cabbage. Hello. I remember you. Hello. I would think so. I would think um, our first meeting was probably pretty memorable. <laughs> well, considering I had to deal with two children and that's all I remember, I'm afraid I, I don't think it was that memorable for me. But oh. do it. What would you like to drink? What kind of tea? Um, so I, I don't know much about tea. Well, that's all right. I'll start you out simple. I'll get you a sweetened black tea. Thank you. Mm -hmm. There you are. And what is your question? Okay, my question is, I feel like someone's probably asked this question to you before, but I feel like it's an important question. Mm -hmm. Where where do you get your your spectacular wardrobe? Mm. Mm, that's a very good question. Oh, no, no, I'm still eating a biscuit. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> mm, really good. That's a really good biscuit. Oh, take your time. Dan. Yeah, they're very good. Mm, yeah. I'm going to another one myself. Mm. Ow, I bit my Thank tongue. Oh. <laughs> Thank goodness they don't have chili dog biscuits. I would die. <laughs> oh, I'd love to have those. I'll be in heaven. Well, thankfully, oh, England has a better taste palette than you Americans, but not being biased or anything. Anywho, um, so my spectacular wardrobe was picked out by a certain small yellow cat that I just happened to have a chance encounter with at a, oh, where was I? I don't remember exactly the location, but we bumped into each other, and I wasn't I was wearing something really nice, but I'm not much of a fashionista. Not really. That was before I became a fashionista. But anyways, so I had I was wearing something casual, I guess, and she took one look at me and said, Oh no 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 no. You have to come with me and we'll get you something that'll fit you. I'm like, Oh, okay. And so we sat down and she took my measurements and asked me a bunch of questions. More questions than I thought would be needed for a wardrobe change. Then she came back with the wardrobe you see me wear now and I was like, That is perfect. That is spectacular. And I walked and she had me walk down that runway. She has a runway in her little shop and I Killed it. I actually made the cover, actually, of her magazine, which, <laughs> spectacular. Um, I just wish I could have gotten Sexiest Man Alive, but that was taken by Idris Elba of that year. But personally, I think I think I have him outclassed by a mile. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, but, um, yeah, that's, it was, I, what was her name? I think it was Honey, maybe. Honey I think cat. that was, that oh, might I be her name. Oh, do yeah, you? I know her. Hmm, yes, a spectacular woman. She taught me everything in that very short time. Well, she didn't teach me everything. She inspired me to look it up myself. And that was when I became very much a fashionista. And now all my wardrobes look spectacular. Oh, I still haven't forgotten the insult you gave me that one time, Sonic. Yeah, don't worry about it, Starline. It's no, a whole new bygones are bygones. Yes. yes. Let's start afresh. Of course. Yes. Anyways, well, thank you. Not... <laughs> yes, thank you for your question, Emerald Cabbage. Thank you for answering my question. That was awesome to hear. All right. Cool. See you all. See you around. Yeah, farewell. Well then. Mm. Mm. Enjoying those biscuits, Sonic? Mm. I sure am. We'll so make you an angle file out of you yet. Mmm. I must say, Starlin, I do love your wardrobe. Oh, well, now you like it, but thank you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, before, yeah, I was a bit like, eh, it's okay. But now it's like, hmm, you know, I see the style. I see the, the yes. glasses and just, ah. Uh, yes, it's it on you. Oh, oh really? go on. Anyways, uh, who's, I think it's my, Remix, did but, you uh, pick it? It's my turn. It's my turn to choose. Right, right. Please, go ahead. Let's go with uh, Dino Kaiju. Yeah. Hello. Hey, oh, hey, yeah. hey. Hi. Hey, hello, guys. Hope you're all having a wonderful day, a wonderful tea time, I should say. Hmm. Oh, yeah. And speaking of tea, what would you like? Hmm. You know, I'm kind of moved for some pomegranate tea, if you don't mind. Oh, good choice. The sweet yet tart flavor of the pomegranate in a tea. <laughs> Here you are. Thank you. Now, what is your and question? it smells good, too. Oh, oh yes, it does. It smells so good. Ah, tasty, too. All right. So, 
for my question is actually going to be for the both of you, for both Sonic and Starline. Mm -hmm. All right. So um, I'm quite curious to hear from the both of you. Um, I'm sure Sonic has more to say, but I'm quite curious to hear your answer as well, Starline. Uh, my question to you two is, what are your thoughts on Sage? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Sage is, uh, is, you know, she's nice. You know, once you get to know her a bit more. I mean, yeah, she's Eggman's daughter, mm -hmm. but, you know, she has her own kind of, like, you know, views on things. Which makes her stand out from, you know, Eggman himself. Oh, yeah, I, I agree. And not so much... Oh, sorry, go ahead, Starline. Go ahead. Go, go for I'll it. I'll be honest with you. I was not familiar with Sage until I had taken over Dr. Eggman's base. I remember when everything was about to go down, going through the files to see what he'd been working on, and I came across, um that uh, the, the, the a little program that said Sage on it. Brushing it aside, I thought of it as nothing, a little hobby that he had come up with, probably another AI robot he was going to have assist the, um, dumb, the, oh, how, how to put this nicely, the henchbots, there you go, the henchbots of Orbot and Gubot, which I'd just taken from him. Um, it wasn't until later when I realized that Sage was something a lot more than I anticipated. I'm looking forward to meeting her one day and perhaps dissecting exactly what it is and what makes it tick. Oh, yeah. In the metaphorical indeed. sense, of course. I mean, like, sitting down and talking with her. I don't think I could offer her any tea. She, of, of course, it's an AI program. Yeah, I was about to say. But I think you'll like her, Starline. She's actually quite nice once you get to know her. No, I am surprised that she's... she's really, if she's related to Eggman in any way, it's not going to end well, I should say. It depends. Again, once you get to know her much. I don't know. She could yeah. end up just like her father. I mean, then again, Sonic can vouch. I mean, she, I mean, even though she kind of met her mysteriously in the Starfall Island, she was good. She was a great of a help there. Oh, this yeah, is something I'm not familiar with. Uh, you have to <clears throat> bring me up to speed later, Sonic. Yeah, I will. We'll, we'll discuss oh, it later. Oh, yeah, definitely. Mm. For sure. Again, this tea is just... Oof. Very good choice of tea where we got here. Pomegranate, mm -hmm. I recommend for those who are interested. Well, thank you and for your question, Dino. Head... No, no problem. Before I go, I must have a biscuit because sharing is caring. Anyway, oh, cool. talk to you guys fail. later. See you guys. Be so around. Long. Thanks for your question. I will. Now, hmm. my dear Sonic, would you like to pick the next person? Yeah, sure. Uh, let's see. I'm going to go for Kevin. Mm. Yeah. Kevin. <clears throat> Bring up the man himself. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hey, hey. hey. So, uh, go, go on. I'll take an English basket tea, please, because I'll need a little pick me up. <clears throat> I'm sorry, oh. nearly choked on a biscuit. Um, what was that? Uh, okay. I, I was saying I'll take an English basket tea, please. Oh, I need yes, a little, little pick me up. How did I forget? There you oh. are. And yes. what is your question? Thank you. Now, my, my question to you is, what is it going to take you to convince Sonic to take Scrooge and Amy to Twinkle Park? Because I am dying to know what happens when more than two people try to get in. Uh, um, mm. I think I actually joked. Hold on. Um, yeah, don't don't choke, so man. Are you, are, you telling, are you telling me that you want Sonic to go on a triple date? With two women, one of them being my ward. Look, I, I, look, listen, here's the reason. I, I know two people get him free because, well, that Mobius Foundation. No, no, yes. no, Kevin, no, wait, 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 Kevin, no, Kevin. wait. Um, one person let, can't. Let the man finish. But believe me, I tried. And Sonic, listen, it, it, it's not that bad. Sure, one of them wants to destroy you, and the other one wants to hit you with your hammer if you get too angry. But it, it, it'll be okay. Listen, and church her, her herself. As long as you don't make me mad. I think he said something about, like, really wanting to hit, hit you good on the bumper card for whatever reason. But you keep me, nah, I'm good. So, so yeah. So, like, well, you got to try and cement them, just somehow. All I mean, right. well, and I'll put this, hold on, Sonic, let me, let me answer this. Okay, anyway, okay. Kevin, no. You see, you have been misinformed. It's not that two people get in for free, because then how on earth would the park make money? 
it's cute couples going for free. And I admit, Sonic and Amy are cute together, maybe. (laughs) My daughter-esque person ward thing is not designed to be cute. She's supposed to be fearsome. She's to strike fear in the heart of her enemies. She's not cute. We already had that discussion long ago. I laughed, um, if you recall. So, um, no, because it would end pretty badly with the girls fighting over who gets Sonic and then Sonic running away like you always do because running from your problems suddenly fixes everything. And, um, yeah, it just wouldn't end well. But... For the sake of argument, let's say it does work. Let's say that these two decide to get along long enough to go with Sonic to Twinkle Park. It still would not work because it's cute couples. Couples, of course, referring to the number two, referring to a pair. So it still would not work because there's three. It's true. It has to be two. They just had to three. They just have to put on the key gag, and it will be a stats, and I'm sure, well, her can, quote-unquote, convince you, them. Be fine. You really want this, don't you, Kevin? Yes, I need to see what happens when three people try to get in. It has never been tested. If you want to see three people get in, just get, just get mimic the two skunk brothers try to go through into Twinkle Park. Then we'll, within, that's, that's a fest right there. Because we'll get the two brothers fighting each other, then mimics in the middle, and they're all beating each other up. And I'm having, I'm over here with the popcorn, and where, where was I? Oh, yes. Anyways, uh, was that your question? Yes, that was, that was my question. Thank you. Oh, and one, one, one day I shall find out what, what happened. They will all see, but thank you for answering well, my yeah, question. Yeah, how about this? Actually, if you want to see three people try to get in, let's get uh, three people off the top of my, my tongue. Uh, oh, right. Mm-hmm. Andrew Hamblin, Di- Dr. Kelp VA, and the ultimate voice actor try to go into Twinkle Park all three. If you want to oh, see three people gosh. get in at the same time. Um, <laughs> that is something I would Pay to see, because I oh, hate that old shit. I, I am all here, Ooh. and I hey, thank you for that suggestion. We just, and thank you for answering my question. All right, Dr. Kelp, if you hear me, I love you almost as much as I do, Eggman. <clears throat> um, <laughs> Sonic, maybe I can at yeah. least throw out one little suggestion. Yeah. Why don't you uh, challenge Shadow to some games, see who wins at the car- at Twinkle Park? Yeah, that sounds that sounds like fun. I, I take Knuckles there quite often. But wait a minute. Me really? and Knuckles going for free. That's weird. Really? Hmm. I, I bet you I bet you and Shadow would be able to get in for free and uh, challenge it. Maybe they just felt sorry that Knuckles was stuck with you, and so they let you in for free. No, wait, no, I know why. They thought why? Knuckles was Amy. How the act You know what? I'm not gonna question it. At this point, I realize that questioning it opens a can of worms. I will have a hard time. Uh, considering how them. today went, uh, yeah, that that is not far fetched at all anymore. The crowd is on edge already. I don't want to poke the bear, so to speak. Uh, no offense to our resident bear in the chat. Hello, Josh. Um, <laughs> we, who is there? Is it the picnic person? Sorry. Uh, I think it's your turn, actually. I think we skipped over you, because you went straight to Sonic. Oh. Oh, well, that's yeah. fine. It's all right. It's all right. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Oh, here's a face I haven't seen in a long time. I don't think she's ever asked a question. To me, anyway. My dear Sushi. Would you come up for a second, please? Sushi! Oh. Hi, Sushi! Hi. Hey, hey, hey! Uh... Hello, Sushi. Hello. Hi. Uh, what kind of tea would you like, my dear girl? Since fall is around the corner, do you have any pumpkin spice tea? Oh, it's in the back somewhere because fall hasn't really come here yet. It's still stinking hot. So I've been eating up all my peach tea, but I do. Of course, I always yeah. have it. You know what I mean. I don't actually eat the tea bags. I brew them first. Da, And it's loose leaf, not bagged. But uh, it turned up right. Okay, I should have said drink. It, besides the point. Uh, <laughs> see, look, look, this is what I'm talking about. You open a can of worms, it's hard to put it back in. You say one wrong thing, everybody just tries to eat you. Um, anyways, here's your 
A pumpkin spice tea. I take it you're a pumpkin spice girl? Sometimes. Oh, well, you need to drink my pumpkin spice tea more often. I'll make you a pumpkin spice girl. Thank you. I know, I know Griff hates pumpkin spice. Oh, it's a tragedy! <laughs> He's missing out. It triggers her wow. allergies. Oh, okay, Ooh. well then all is forgiven. Allergies are always the acceptable excuse. Always. Anyways, Thank what's you. your question, Sushi? My question for you is... Have you had agave nectar before? Of course. Sometimes I use it as a replacement for sugar because it's healthier. Or so I I'm told. Agree. Yes, agave um, syrup is a great uh, sweetener substitute for sugar. I tried no. to get some from the store once, and I got the wrong kind because mm, I didn't know there was two kinds. Whoopsies. Ah, uh, that's important. That's very important. Though personally, I don't try to drink tea with with any sort of additives. <laughs> I try drinking it s straight up. Just. No additives, just brew the tea, and that's it. Sometimes I'll add a little... There's some teas that are just way too bitter for my taste, so I have to add a, a little bit of sweetener, but I know if I add too much, it'll become too sweet, and then I'll get addicted, and, you know, it's, it's snowballed into a bigger addiction, and then, you know, I'm in the I'm in the psych ward for a sugar addiction. But, yeah, see, the, you have to be oh. very careful with that. I like sugar. There's, there's, Sometimes. Okay, Sorry, go ahead. It's all right. There's a type of tea my mom bought recently for me and my uh, grandmother to try. It has sweetness already in it. So once you steep it, you don't have to add anything. I think it's like freeze-dried agave, probably, and then they put it in with the oh. tea leaves. It's oh. pretty good. It's orange spice or something. I can't I remember. Think, I don't think I've had of it. I'll have to give it a shot. Yeah, it's quite good. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you for your question, Sushi. Of course. All right. Take care. Right. Well, uh, my dear Whispering. Would you like to pick the expense? Yes, sir. Uh, well, sure. Why not? Huh? All right. Who have we here? Uh, let's bring up my Ito. Oh, my Ito. I have not seen him in a long time. What's up? Hello, my Ito. Hey, hey Dr. Starline. How is it going? It's going spectacular, though a little hot. What kind of tea would you like? Oh, um, uh, I'll have one. I'll try one of the chili dog tea. There's no such thing <laughs> as chili dog tea. There's green, there's herbal, there's black, there's oolong, but there is not Maybe chili it's time dog. Time for change. Time for change, Starline. Green tea. Let's do chili dog. Green tea. Thank you for being sensible. Okay. <laughs> Here is your green tea. Now, what is your question? Uh, thanks. Okay. So, um, have you did any uh, crazy lately, Dr. Starline? Uh, repeat the question you cut out just briefly. Oh, I'm um, sorry. Um, uh, did you do any crazy schemes lately? Crazy schemes? <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> No. Not recently. Uh, no crazy schemes? That well, I mean, if you consider stealing the Rolls Royce a crazy scheme, then yes. <laughs> but that was that was way, way long time ago. Um I have had my eye on my neighbor's uh like uh, old GT, uh, like the from the sixties. Right. Those are rare. Um I've been thinking the about GT from the sixties, I've never seen that. I've been thinking about maybe borrowing it for a spin. Indefinitely? But we'll, we'll get to, of course, that bridge when we get to it. And thank, you for, thank you for your question. Then. Goodbye now. You're welcome. Bye. Uh, sushi said something about using chili dog seasonings and put it in cheesecloth. Ew. Ooh. You know, Sushi, don't, I, 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 I wouldn't want to inform the, the, the World Tea Society about this. And I, uh, they would have to blacklist you. I wouldn't want that to happen to you because you seem like <laughs> a very nice, decent young lady. Unlike that other nice, decent young lady that we will not mention. <laughs> Anyways. Um, <laughs> so she yeah, says, all, oh, you're right. Uh, sorry, all doctor. All is forgiven, dear girl. All is forgiven. Anyways. Uh, 
my it's... turn to choose somebody. Yes, correct. Oh. And Griff, Oreo Pepsi is something completely different. That's soda. They can do whatever they want with soda. They cannot do the same thing with tea. All right? <laughs> Have we covered that? Thank you. <laughs> All right, now you get to pick a person. Okay, uh, let's go with uh, Drago. Oh, I haven't seen that person in a while. <laughs> Drago, Drago. Mm. They were just there. Mm. They just... Oh, what, a what a shame. Anyways, pick them up. For now, can't person. join. Why did you have your hand raised then? Oh, <laughs> because people be people, you know. Pick another person. Oh, I will. Uh, let's go with Miles Tails co -prower. Oh my goodness gracious, that's a name I have not heard in a long time. A lot of returning faces, I'm so happy. Hello, my dear. Hello, what kind of tea would you like, my dear girl? Hmm. Oh, hey, Sonic. Hey, what's up? Hmm, how about peace tea? Yes, I bet. Ha <clears throat> Excuse me, my nose got congested for a brief second there. I'm all right now. Uh, I think I have a little bit in the back. Hold on one second. Ah, uh, yes, perfect. Here you are. What is your question? I do have a question. Good. I'm excited Stop to hear. It. It. Oh, all right. <laughs> cool. Okay. How was your Sonic? No. Oh. Uh, oh. How was Tails and Knuckles doing? Yeah, Tails and Knuckles are okay. Um, I think Tails is being a bit too busy lately with machines and making new stuff. So making me feel a bit left out, I guess. I asked him about going for a race, and he was like, oh, I'm going to work on my new machine. And I was like, okay, I'll go and try and uh, chill out with Knuckles. And what? Well, I was, I was going to say, we all know the truth of what Tails is really doing. He's spending time with his baby. Mm, yeah, the tornado. Oh, mm -hmm. yes. Planes like her need a little TLC, if you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. mm, that's oh. true. You Knuckles gotta make the like... machine, you what? know. Sorry, what was Knuckles' ex uh, excuse? Uh, well, Knuckles didn't say anything. He just said he's busy. And he pleads the fifth. <laughs> that's it? That, that, I, I thought it was, hmm. Well, we can't make a scandalous mm. joke about that. What well, can we? Can we make a patriotic joke about that? No, we can't. Nothing makes sense with pleading the fifth. Anyway, yeah. well, I, I'm sure he's doing fine. We all know what Tails is up to because it's pretty obvious. All right, well, who, who cares about those two anyway? You have us now. We're your friends now, Sonic. We'll take good care of you. Yeah, that's that's true. We'll be a you, smile when you need it, and a shoulder for you to cry on. That is true. <laughs> Give me a hug, Starline. Uh, what? Uh, that was unexpected. <laughs> <laughs> there, there. Um, okay. Uh, you can let me know now. That's indeed. fine. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yes. There you go. Uh, oh, you're still here? Uh, sorry about that. They, 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 thank you for your question, uh, uh, Miles. No problem. All right, have a good day. You too. Yeah, that was awkward. Or right, is it my turn again? Yes. All right. I'm probably going to bring the house down with this. Oh, boy. But I'm going to bring Cutie Cat VA up. Let's see what happens. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, bring the house down? What are you going to do? Uh, I don't know. Screech so loud that the glass breaks in my house. <laughs> You know, that could happen. Okay, you ain't, ru you ain't wrong about that. <laughs> mm -hmm. What kind of uh, tea would you like? Wait, I gotta ask first. Do you microwave your tea? No. Okay, you're not blacklisted. All right, uh, what, what kind of tea would you like? Okay, before, okay, before, I, answer, uh, before I answer, Lila, I see you in, Lila, I see you in, in the audience. Do not, do not judge me. Uh, do you have any uh, catnip tea? Uh... Wait, that actually uh, exists. Yeah. Like, I'm not kidding. It it does. I'm I'm not kidding. Like, literally, <laughs> look it up. 
Oh, you are funny. That was a funny joke. <laughs> That's hilarious. I can't imagine looking right now through all. Uh, she's, not she's, she's, she's not joking. She's 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 not joking. If you don't have it, listen, I'll, 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 I'll take something else. Let, let, let me let me let me let me let me just answer this real quickly. I'm sure it's a fever dream on the internet. You can't believe everything on the internet. I'm sure, looking right now through all my teeth, there is no way there is a box. Of- there's an article on, on Healthline.com. Yes, and there's a box of it. Oh, my God. What the heck? Where did oh this God. come from? <laughs> Where did this? Uh, would you like it iced I or heated? I told you it exists. Would you like it iced or heated? Heated. Why did I say heated? I it's Atlantic and be making that. Yeah, it's coming right like heated. Sweetened or not sweetened? Sweetened with honey. All right. Uh, okay. I, I, to- I told you I'm, I'm not crazy. A lot, <laughs> of people, a lot of people would be surprised with that. I don't know where it came from. Did I, I, just I, I just don't know it existed. I mean, I buy my teas in bulk from a very, very, very expensive website. And, you know, I I guess it just slipped in with the other orders, I, I, I guess. Hey, 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 you, hey, you, hey you are. Um, it actually doesn't smell too bad. First, first time trying it for me. It's an herbal tea. Ah, oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. I guess I just never, hmm. I wonder. Uh, yeah. Actually, you know, I am working for Princess Plays. I wonder if she'd like it. Hmm. 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 I don't know why I'm hmm. doing doing that. Hmm. Because saying hmm is fun when yeah. you're thinking devilishly. <laughs> Anyways, what is your question? Okay. Yeah. So, um, this is to this question is to the two of you. It, it is. If you could go back and if you could go somehow go back in time and change one thing about your life, what would it be and why? I would account for every single contingency, including the fact that Eggman had accounted for once every single contingency. So that way I would account for not only all the other contingencies, but his contingencies and his accounting for my contingencies of his contingencies. And then my accounting for his contingencies are my contingencies of his contingencies. Yeah, Meaning so- I would win and that I would be ruler of the world and Surgeon Kit would be uh, my enforcers and Sonic and Tails would be dead. Awesome. Somebody mad wow. their little plan didn't work. Aww. It's sort of why I did the, so, so, Sorry, I <laughs> let my emotions got better of me. <laughs> I was very unprofessional. I apologize. Sonic, um, forget what I said about you being dead. What would you change about your mm-hmm. life? Well, um, you know, I don't think I'll change anything. Because... Everything I've done has led to this. So if I change anything, we wouldn't be here today. So I guess I'll leave everything as it is. What a very boring answer. answer. Come on, there's got to be one thing you would want to change. Hmm. One thing if I could change. Hmm. You know, it's a tough question, but... It really is. Hmm. Unless you're presumed dead because of a mistake you did, then it's pretty easy. What? But again, a certain someone's no, plan didn't work, did it? You hush. And you <laughs> come on, that. Sonic. Are you sure you wouldn't want to change the fact that there is no such thing as chili dog tea? Ooh. When you put it like that, I guess I'll change the teas. There's you know there's Make also no such thing tea. as chili dog um coffee. Or chili dog uh, plants, or chili dog uh, anything good, no, stop. except the chili stop. dog itself. Stop. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. The only chili dog um, thing I know exists is chili dog toothpaste, and I hate that I know that knowledge. Oh, it's it's so good. Trust me. Now please I, tell me you don't actually I eat the toothpaste. I brush and eat the toothpaste. Ugh. Okay, it's we're moving on. Trust, Trust me. No. <laughs> Kid, it's awesome. really nice. <laughs> uh, I'm surprised you haven't gotten sick from it just from the fluoride. Ugh. Unless, unless you yeah, explore for some reason. Unless it's, unless it's edible, I guess if it's edible, it's fine. <laughs> there are some edible toothpaste. 
I use it sometimes when I'm traveling. It saves <clears throat> time, and it's sometimes pretty good. Anyways, thank you for your question, cutie cat, and enjoy your catnip tea. No, no, no right, problem. Boys, that's see, yeah, see, bolt, bolt. Bolt. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry, see, see. That's okay. No, both, was, both, was, both the werewolf was mentioning, yeah, you, you're not supposed to eat toothpaste. You'll get fluoride poisoning. Yeah. See, see you later. I'm, I'm just going to ignore what the, the whole hug thing that just happened. Oh, yeah. right. Yes. Oh, the hug. Hi. That's just me, you know, saying thank you to Starline. You're welcome. That's unusual. Catnip tea is an herbal remedy that can help with anxiety, insomnia, and gastrointestinal issues. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Apparently it's good for you, this catnip tea. You're actually looking into it. Uh, hmm. You know what? Well, I want to try some of that. Hey, Starlight, give me some catnip. I'm a tea enthusiasm myself, right. if you didn't um, know. Wait, you, 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 uh, sorry, you what? You what? What? Um, what? I like tea. I'm a really into tea, I personally. Oh, you've had this catnip tea before, have you? Yes. Oh, is it good? Yeah. Oh, what does it taste like? Well, it's just a standard. It just tastes like tea. I mean, it, if I were to compare it to anything. Does it have a tangy, zesty, tea? or is it tangy, zesty, uh, lemony? What is it? What is it? What is, does it have? More minty. Minty. All right. You know what? Sounds like I'll do something of that. Yeah. Oh it's no! Catnip. It's in the mint family. Yeah, catnip's in the mint family. Tea, Not the mint thing. No, great. He's going to start drinking catnip <laughs> tea now. Uh, okay, everyone. Let's, let's Let all keep them. hush. Let's all keep hush hush about the mint tea around tails. All right. <laughs> He's already of course, addicted of enough. Course. Yes, yeah, and it's true. Let's keep it hush hush from when tails. Are we, when are we ever going to have a mint intervention panel with tails? It needs to happen. We need to have a serious talk. Can't handle this. All right. Okay. Silence. Just too much silence. What is this? Oh. Are Are you okay? Uh, I'm trying. I, I'm I'm putting a. I'm trying to put a puzzle together. Oh. <laughs> Said puzzle is why are we being so quiet when uh, the fact that we're supposed to be answering questions and start oh, line sorry, handing I got, out tea. I got side, sorry, I got side. I got sidetracked. My bad. You anyway. know, talking about good D's always get me in a oh, very yeah. conversational mood. But anyways, you can do it. Uh, we do have a panel to run. Uh, whose turn yeah. is it to pick a person? Uh, it's it's Sonic's turn. Right, Sonic, pick a person. Any person. Let's see. Um. Hmm. Let's go for uh, Sonic Heroes. Hey everyone, it's me, Sonic Heroes. Hey, uh, hey, hey. Uh, I have one question. Oh, so what was your favorite part of the Sonic Hedgehog movie free trailer? Favorite part of the trailer, huh? Yeah. I guess seeing uh, Shadow in the film is yes. quite cool. Uh, Shadow is going to be in a film. It'll be a, a big day for December. Oh, it's yeah, definitely. Be, yes, I'm going to see the, the Star Trek movie free with my family and friends. Sweet. Me and Tails plan to see it in our Shadow onesies. <laughs> yes. You have Shadow onesies? Yeah, we do, yeah. Does Shadow know this? I think he does. I, I remember why, we told him about it. And why do you have Shadow onesies? For the film. We're going to celebrate Shadow. You know, it's the year of Shadow after all. Oh, right. Yeah. That's true. Uh, that's true. So I'll be wearing a Shadow onesie. Tails Bear wearing one. I think Knuckles is coming wearing one as well. And I'll be, be fun. The camera. I mean, what? Uh huh. Um. <laughs> you should come, Starline. Oh, you can dress goodness. up to Shadow too. Oh, no, 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 no. Thank you. My dignity only goes so low. Come on, I think you look cool dressed as Shadow. If I'm going in any onesie, it's in a Jim Carrey onesie. Mm, I think you should come as Shadow. No, listen, yes. Shadow and I don't see eye to eye in a lot of things, and we both mutually hate each other, so it, it wouldn't work out. Okay, you can go as uh, uh, a Tails onesie. I think he'd rather go yeah, as uh, well. Eggman with an Eggman onesie. Yes! Who else would I go as? I could go as myself, though. Hey, is there any Starline onesies I could borrow? 
<clears throat> no. What a pity. Yeah, sorry. Well, uh, thanks for your question. Okay, bye. 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 It's it all. Well then, by the way, my, my favorite part of the uh, the trailer was seeing all the Easter eggs and Shadow, of course, and seeing Shadow doing that Akira slide on the bike. Mm-hmm. He's so fast, he needs a bike. He looks so cool do- dro- riding it. Yeah, I gotta admit, he does. And his voice. Remarkable. His voice is really cool as well. Very smooth. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Keanu Reeves was a very, very smart pick for voicing Shadow. I, I just find it funny that a a fan casting uh, actually got made into reality. Listen, listen. Sonic said it best. He is a national treasure. Mm. Like, literally. Like, I, I had my hopes on that Skywalker guy. I forget his name. But literally, Keanu Reeves is just... I can't unsee it now. He fits the role perfectly. Like, yeah. Oh. yeah, too perfect. It's just He's breathtaking. So awesome. I want to be like him if he was evil when I grow up. Oh, don't worry, Starlight. One day you'd be like him. I want to be as chill as he is. Like, the man is just... I've seen interviews with him, and he's just... Oh, he, he just handles, handles on his, like, eh, whatever. It's just a roll. It's just like, how do you... How do you not get your ego in the way? That... But anyways... Because he's been marked as one of the most humble men in Hollywood. He really is, though. He walks around not in his suit and with, like, bodyguards in, like, sla- like in jeans and stuff. Like, you take the bus or the subway. <laughs> well, who is this guy? <laughs> um, but anyways, yes. Um, um, who's, who's, seems he's a celebrity that prefers more of a low... He prefers uh, the quiet life. Level-headed. Yes, yeah, a quiet yeah. life. I respect that. Uh, whose turn is it? He's a co owner of a it'll motorcycle. Be, uh, it'll be hey. Whispering's turn. Ah, uh, yes. Go ahead, my good sir. Ah. Uh, of course. All right. Well, this one caught my attention. Bolt the Werewolf. Ooh. Halloween's coming. So. Nice name. Yeah, drop your silver. All right. We're... Am I not seeing it anymore? For... I must be blind. Do you need some help? Red's the bottom. Okay, I'm going to. Minimize this because that's not helping. Here we go. There you go. Oh, hey. Hello. Hi. No. What would Hello. you like? What kind of tea would you like? Yeah, I'm sorry to bring this up, but do you have any peppermint tea? No, that's completely all right. I have plenty. I have plenty. Here yeah, my anxiety's are. been through the roof since. Oh, this will help. This will definitely help. I assure you. Now, what is your question? So, um, like, what would uh, be, like, the worst thing you could do? The worst thing I could do? Hmm. The worst thing? I guess solve mm. world hunger. That... Oh, you mean worse for the world, not for me. Oh, okay, um, well, if we're talking at the expense of everyone else, I suppose what I was going to do, which is basically take over the world and control the elements and all that, uh, you know... I guess that could be the worst thing. Mm. Zonic? Well, worst thing I could do is, I guess, fail? Let everyone down? Well, that's not going to happen. <laughs> Pride is certainly not an issue with this one. Oh, no, not a dip. <laughs> well, <laughs> thanks for the question. All right, see ya. Okay, I need to clear something up because I now feel kind of stupid. Uh, earlier, were we talking about Keanu Reeves or Hugh Jackman? Because I'm mentioning Hugh Jackman in the chat. Uh, Keanu Reeves. Reeves. Okay, just Keanu checking. Reeves. I was like, if I was talking about Hugh Jackman this entire time, I would have felt so yeah. dumb. Cause... <laughs> I mean, you were talking Hello. about how you want to be like Reeves and you want to be Starlight Reeves and everything. Come on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> the Nothing needs to be said about that. Uh, who's, uh, Remix, is it your turn? My turn, yeah. Okay, uh, go I'm going to try again to bring Drago up because uh, they said right. they're ready now, so. All right. There we go. go. All hey, right, hey, hey. good to see you. Good to see you. What kind of um, uh, tea would you like? No, it's so fun. You want me to take some tea, right? Um, what can you recommend for, since I live in Australia, 
Spring's pretty much around the corner. What's a good tea for spring? Mm, good question. I would recommend something more on the herbal side instead of just straight black tea. So maybe like a green or oolong tea, um, which are not herbal. I just realized. I just um, I'm 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 over. Say. I'm um, thirsting. I'm looking at all my teas. And I'm getting distracted. Uh, something. If I was going to go something herbal, though, uh, I would say maybe like a lemon or or something a little more tart. Like your, tra- it's like a transition from winter to summer. So, you know, your. It's winter for me, but it's about to be spring. Exactly. Like I said, you're like. So it's, since it's more like beginning of winter, sorry, end of winter, beginning of spring. Ah, ba, 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 um, apple cinnamon spice. It sounds like a full tea, and it is, but it can be drunk in the winter time. It's not too Christmassy, and it's, but it's it's not too fallsy either. It's a very underappreciated tea flavor, actually. Indeed, I agree. Thank you. Yeah, it always gets overshadowed by the pumpkin spice, but apple cinnamon spice, mmm, so good. It's just spectacularly good when you're sick as well. I just heard nothing, so I'm going to be quick with my question, uh, and it's for Sonic. Um, I don't know if I'm okay to ask this question, because um, have you ever wanted to meet Mega Man again someday? I think that Ooh, question's for Mega you, Sonic. I have no idea what this person's talking about. Yeah, I'd like I to see uh, Mega Man again. I haven't seen him in a long time. We had that big crossover adventure with, with the other, you know, characters like Knights and everything, and it was fun. Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'd like to see him again sometime. Maybe one day I can bring him down as a guest here at Revo. That'd be fun. Ooh. Oh, that would be really cool. Maybe even bring some of the Mega Man X characters along, too, because, of course, they're part of the Mega Man series, and you didn't meet them before. Albeit only for mm-hmm. a short time. Yeah, why not? Well, thank you for your question. Thank you for your question, Welcome Drago. You, All, well, right. I, 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 All right. Take care. <laughs> All right, it's my turn, and I've had my eye on this person for a while. I'm going to call up uh, the ultimate fish actor. I have several questions about that. I'm curious. Oh, boy. Mm-hmm. Uh, but, okay. Uh, but, mm. The name sounds similar to ultimate voice actor. Oh, I hate him. If this Who person doesn't? any if if this person is in any way related to that horrid man, I will be very upset. Mm. Are they even there? Ah, uh, there we go. And hey. they're muted. Sounds like something. Yes. Hey, y'all! Yeah. I'm the ultimate. Vo- I I mean, fish actor. <laughs> you wouldn't be in any way related to that uh, ultimate voice actor guy, would you? Don't worry about it. I, uh, all right. I just, just, just wondering for n- no particular reason. Uh, what kind of uh, tea would you like? I Ultimate prefer coffee. Oh uh, well, actually, it's not a good choice. Not, not a good choice. I drink it, idiot. That's not a bad choice either. Um, I have. Would you like it black or blonde or in the black. middle? Black. Uh, any cream or sugar? sugar. No, because I'm just that ultimate. I see. I see. All right. Ah, uh, here you are. Black. Perfect. Coffee. I think you no. and Kevin would get along pretty well. <laughs> now I have a very important question. Please lay it on me. I am dying to know your question. Will you marry me? Hey, yo. Wow. Oh, oh. I just got proposed on my own panel. Mm-hmm. That depends, actually. Uh, what do you? What do I? What do you have to offer me? Why should I make you my partner? I can microwave tea. <laughs> Mods and this person immediately. <laughs> I am writing to the World Tea. Association immediately letting the ultimate fish actor. See, I knew you had some <laughs> correlation to that ultimate guy. I knew it. Get this person off my stage immediately. So I'm guessing that's a no on the marriage. Oh, that is a heck no. Off. Oh, man. I was hoping you were going to get married, Starline. I wanted to be your best, you know, best man. 
Oh, I knew he must have been a spy from that ultimate. I knew it. I knew it. I don't ever want to see that person on my panel, on my stage, on my own T network again. <sighs> yeah, calm okay. down. Okay, calm, calm down. down. <sighs> calm down. Here, have a tea. Have some tea. <clears throat> okay, <sighs> breathe. Just in, out. Did it taste nice? Did it taste nice? Oh, oh it's all right. I'm all How right. was the taste? I'm... Was it good tea? Yes, it. It was because nice. I put some chili dog in it. Darling. Yeah. Bend over. Why? Bend over. And now oh. you're receiving the kick of punishment. <laughs> And if I ever catch you putting uh, Chili Dog in my tea again, you will get a... Uh, what's it called? It'll get something. I know, I can't think of it at the moment because I'm so angry. Ah. It's just a prank, man. Take a chill pill. You chose the absolute worst time for a prank, Mr. Hedgehog. I need a minute. Go on with the next person. I, I need a minute. <laughs> Poor buds. Okay, uh, yeah. Sonic, I think it's your turn. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, let's go for Angie. Mm. Oh, there we go. Angie! Hi. Angie. <laughs> yeah, hi. Is she okay? <laughs> I'm kind of concerned now. <laughs> yes, he's okay. <laughs> hey, just, um, Starlight, calm down. <laughs> Angie's here. Oh, he's just blowing uh, off some steam. Angie, uh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> you caught me. Out you, okay? you caught me at a really bad time. I, my honor and integrity was insulted just now, and then Sonic had to taint my tea. I, it was a joke. It was a prank. Poorly timed, but I get you meant well. I, I just, I needed a minute. Ah, uh, yes. What? Hey, what kind of tea would you like, my dear? Um, um. Do you have any um green tea? I'm I'm sorry. I don't. You're kind of. You're kind of in a. This this is a uh this is a oh. little um advice for everyone involved anywhere don't 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 mess with starline's tea no matter if it's a prank or not you can make fun of my wardrobe you can make fun of my hair you can insult my mother but you don't touch my tea and you don't insult my tea either got it and you don't microwave it either here's your green tea my dear the tea is the sacred thing it is most sacred it was made by gods I'm a little on hinge at the moment. I apologize. What is your question, my it's dear? Okay. Um, speaking of your wardrobe, that's actually what my my question was about. Um, what is your favorite piece of clothing you own? Wait, you say it again. What is your favorite piece of clothing you own? Ooh, my glove, of course. Of course, yeah, it'll be pretty, the glove. Pretty nice glove. Yes, I made it myself when I was working on the warp oh. topaz. Nice. Ooh. I've had several of them made, actually, over the course, because I'd break them or they were stolen. You know, it happens. Mm. Well, thank you, uh, Angie, for asking a legitimate question. I'm sorry, Starlight. It, it, it's all right. I, I, I truly appreciate it, my dear. Thank you <laughs> so much for coming back and putting the sunshine back in, in my day. You're welcome. All right, run along now. I hear you guys. <laughs> Be around. Uh, well, Sonic, you did a good thing by bringing Angie on. Angie's a good way to calm him down. Yeah. Oh, speaking of coming and down, he looks like he could use a cup of green tea himself. Yeah. And maybe some biscuits. Oh my goodness. Fish actor is like, uh, so, uh, rain check on the wedding? Rain check? You've summoned a whole hurricane that's going to stay. No. I still think you should get married, Starline. 
I think I think it would suit you very much. I mean, I've thought about it. I just haven't found the right girl, I guess. Why don't you make one? I mean, you're a genius. Uh, 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 no. Making making uh, making a significant other is usually a pretty big no no. If you know every trope in television history can tell you. I was not born yesterday. I will tell you that much. Yeah, but Starline's a genius. He can make Mrs. Starline, you know? No. A robot no. version of himself with oh, eyelashes gosh, no. and makeup. No, lips. I, listen, no, oh. no. I, I'm telling you, Sonic, it is a bad idea no matter how genius he may be. A uh, no fish actor. <laughs> that was a no. 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 Also, I want to answer Josh's question really quickly. What did he say? What if your mother's tea sucks outside of the microwave? Don't insult my mother's tea either. If well, you do, my dear Joshua, I will help you lose weight. Oh, by carving oh, off a pound oh, of flesh. Oh, oh no, my gosh. Oh. Wow. Listen, oh, it's in Shakespeare, uh, so I can say it here. Merchant of Venice, look at well, it up. It's a great play. Well, it's a shame about the wedding. I was hoping to be your, you know, best man, but oh well. Listen, listen, fishy. If you are so heck bent on getting married, why don't you go marry that ultimate guy you're in cahoots with? Because you're so intent on making me suffer. Besides, he's so trash. I'm sure he, you go. We both would get along. He probably microwaves his tea too old. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, I think I'm done venting now. I, I, think I, I'm I was going to say, I was going to say, uh, maybe we should uh, move on and bring on the next guest, uh, Whispering's turn, by the way. Yes, please, Whispering, pick somebody good, please. Uh, okay, Rainbow Blitz. Uh. Oh, thank Wait a minute, she microwaves her tea, doesn't she? Uh, um, I don't know, ask her? Yes? Oh, uh, uh, yep. Yeah, oh, no. I double checked you're on the list. Oh, and you're such a sweet person, too. You're just around bad company. Listen, if you promise to change your ways, I'm sure I can put in an appeal for you. Okie dokie. Um, Good. You just have to promise me you will not microwave your tea anymore. Kettle. Buy yourself a kettle. They're like $15 on Amazon. You can get anything on Amazon for cheap. $15. Get a kettle. Put it on the stove. Put the water in it. Boil it. Put it with the tea. It's not that difficult, and it's a lot faster. It's not wrong. Thank you. Somebody <laughs> understands whispering. Where have you been in my entire life? Aw. <laughs> uh, there, there. Let me give you a gentle hug, kind of like Sonic. That's fine. What is your question, Rainboom? Yeah, I... Well, I have a actually I have a question for you, Doctor Stoneline. Um, okay. So I am when, praying oh, it's right. something legitimate. All right. What was the best moment? Moment? Best moments you've done so far? Thank you. Um, I think my crowning achievement was creating Surgeon Kit. That was a painful but beneficial process. It was spectacular. I see. <laughs> Anyways, yes, thank you for your for your question. Next time we have a tea time, you have to let me know, and I'll let you know if your appeal ha the appeal has been taken or not. You know. It all, just all right then. All right. Thank then. you. All right, run along now. All right now. You take care. Sorry, I'll, I hope you're doing okay. Well, yeah, take well, care. I, I'll I'll be better. Thank you. Uh, uh, all right. Take care. Bye. Bye. See you around. Oh my goodness. Why is everybody talking about marriage in the chat? I, I, someone has said it best because someone has said this best. Every man should have his own wife. Or I don't husband. Know, well, wouldn't that imply the husband, the woman gets the husband too? I mean, I don't know. I've just heard this before and I think it should be true because then I wouldn't be pestered by all uh... <laughs> Who said is it? Uh, my turn, actually. I need to recover. My mascara is running out on me. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm going well, to have to reapply uh, after this. All right, we're bringing on Goken. That's not good. 
You know, it's not. Ask anybody who wears mascara. It runs. Oh, I didn't runs. know that I was invited to a tea party. No kidding. You, no. you had your hand you. up. Yeah, I, I know. I'm just like, I probably Unless forgot. Unless okay. you're a troll, like that ultimate fish guy. You all know, what, you all know me, I'm a troll. But anyways. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. I'm making sure it's easy for you. Okay, Starline? Because so, I know. Hey, Kaya. I heard, every, I heard every, we all heard you. How are okay. you feeling? Do you like tea? Absolutely. So, what kind of tea would you like? I'd like to have a mango green tea. Ooh. Ooh. I haven't had that in a couple of years. Let's see if I can. Yes. I got it right here. Hey, you are. I'm actually wondering if mango is actually around in the universe. Anywho. It's a little, it, it's, it's, here's a hypothetical question for Sonic and Dogger Starline. If you two were to switch bodies for a day, what chaos would ensue? Ooh. Switch, switch, switch bodies who? Switch Sonic. Me. You, like Sonic and Starline, switching bodies for a day. Ooh. Oh. Well, just to clarify, I would still have all my genius and intellect, right? Nope, well, you're going to you're going to be the fastest spe fa fastest beating hedgehog. Ah, well, I guess if I switched bodies with Sonic, I would I wouldn't be as smart, but I would be more versatile and quick thinking on my feet. That's one of the things I tried to replicate with Serge when studying Sonic. He 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 really knows how to adjust to any situation. I mean, he has to be the fastest thing alive for a reason. Oh, that would be thanks, a useful Starlight. feature. Yeah, that would be a useful feature to have. Hmm. Well, if I swap through Starline, you know, I guess I'd like to see what it's like to make some inventions. Oh, and maybe, like, it would actually make that chili dog tea. It's not possible, and, Sonic. And, and, chili dog and teas tea. Are made, it, teas are made from plants. Chili dogs are not plants. Hey, 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 if I've swapped bodies of you, I can give it a go. Listen, I'm brilliant, but even I know that some bounds cannot be passed in so in science. Yes, Let me you know. Me, Sonic, there oh, is no, no. no oh, such oh, oh, thing as a chili dog tea. Yes, but if I'm going to be you, then I can do whatever I want, right? So, oh, Sonic, if I was I've in your body... I've already had a very long evening and I don't want to argue with you about this. How about we just agree to disagree, please? I was just asking the question. I was just saying, like, I would, if I was you, I would, I would make the chili dog tea, and I would, just, you know... Let's just end it at that, please. Okay, fine. I want to give you one thing, I want one suggestion, Sonic. I hope, I hope it's worse than the chili dog G fuel flavor. Ugh! Oh, I drank that on a dare, and it was the worst decision of my life. I did too, and it was and it was better, and I got used to it. Anyway, well, thank, thank you, for, thank you for answering my question. I hope you and Starline take a deep breath. I'm pretty sure you, I'm. We're having a really great tea time, thanks to you. Uh, thank you. All right, toodles. See you around. <laughs> I see Fish Actor is still at it. <laughs> They're trying to get me with the... Hey, guys! Oh, they are bent. Uh, what is going on? <laughs> well, uh, I guess everyone just wants to see you get married. You know, if only Gab Sam was here, then it would really blow up. Right? Where is Gab? He's... Gab Sam. Oh, I know. All right, well, whose turn is it now? Uh, your turn, actually. Oh, all right. Um, 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 um hmm. Okay. Uh, uh, let's, let's go with Ruby Rose VA. I've not seen that name in a while. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hey. How are you guys doing today? Doing great. Uh, it could be better. Are, are you sure yeah, you're okay, Doctor? I've seen what's been I going on. I said it could be better. That implies I'm not okay. But besides <laughs> the point, 
What kind of tea would you like? I'm sorry. It's it's fine. It's, it's here. Fine. If you want some spare mascara, I got you some right here. Oh, you are a lifesaver. Thank you. I shall reap, well reapply done. uh while you uh ask your question. I'll get to your tea after you after you uh, you ask your question. All right. Um, I don't know. I guess this is like my I guess to everyone. Uh you know, if you had a favorite meal you would like to have on your birthday, what would it be? Well, <laughs> Chili dogs, of course. <laughs> huh, well, oh, so oh, I'm still, I'm still applying. Hold on a minute. Ah, that's a, <laughs> you're fine, doctor. Take your time. Ah, that's a good question. Um, uh, personally, I wouldn't say no to a crumble. Mm. Yes, uh, uh, perhaps a, a blueberry crumble. Those are really good. Ooh, I love those. Those are really. Those are. No, really if good. I'm going. Out. Sorry to interrupt, but if I'm going out, I will say a a Knickerbocker Glory is also an excellent treat to have your birthday. Hmm. Never had one before. It's from my home country. It's 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 a it's a layered uh, ice cream sundae. Hmm. Guess I'm gonna have to try it next time. Mm, or if I can by. even make something like that, since Indeed. I am a bit of a baker. It's top shelf. Yes. All right. Well, what kind of tea would you like? I would actually like a strawberry boba, if you don't mind. Oh, boba. I love boba. Because last boba. time you did recommend me some boba, and I did try it. And oh, it isn't it good? Boba. It is good. It is yes. amazing. Impeccable. It's it's so... What's the word? Delightful. It's very there's delightful. A, there's actually a, a boba shop that's right near like the, the lab and they make our excellent strawberry uh, boba tea. Uh, strawberry milk tea with boba, actually. It's what it's really called and it's really good. Oh, Ooh. here you are, my dear. Oh, I thank you so much. All right. Thank All you right. very much. Yeah, no problem. You take care. You hang in there, doctor. Um, thank you for answering my question. All right. Good to see time. you. Bye bye. Ah, that was delightful. I'm glad they took my recommendation. Hmm. Well, you are a genius. Of course, of course, of course. All right. Ah, Sonic, it's your turn. Oh, right. Um, let's see. I'm gonna choose. I'm turn my mic back on. Uh -huh. Did you Sorry, see the you art know. in the uh the the chat there? Uh, you mean the one of me from that certain, uh, uh, oh, has been hotel character? Yeah. Hmm. It Ooh. does fit. He is classy. You do look kind of scary, actually. Well, take the good with the bad, is what I always say. In your teeth, it's like, it's like you're a shark or something. Yes, yes. Hmm. Starline the shark. Horrible. No, 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 let's not get too far out of hand. The fan base already saying. has enough of me to draw. I don't want to be cursed any more than I already have been. Let's move on. Okay, okay. Um, let's see. I'm going to go for... Uh, Sega Gamer 007. All right. This is just cursed. This post that cursed stuff. Wait, what? Uh, I don't no. know if you can hear me that well. I'm having to use a different mic than I usually do because I lost it. But uh, anyway, uh, uh, first of all, what the heck is happening to this panel? Um, we're having tea. Yeah. We're talking about things. What in the name of, of Eggman's mustache am I looking at? That is the most what cursed thing I've seen today. What? 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 Is is what? Yeah. What is this? Is that? Sausages? Wait, it's actual chili dog tea. It, it, it. That's it, not how I visualize no. it. No, not at all. Oh, that is disgusting. That, yeah. that, that is that is that an abomination. Is I agree, Josh. Josh. I agree. No, Whoever I made that is, in tea. fact, not going just to hell, but to the lowest ring. <laughs> Hi. Uh -huh. yeah, I, uh, I, I do not okay, microwave okay. my tea. Thank you very much. Okay, cool. What's, what kind of tea would you like? I'm going to go bleach my eyes. Uh, I think I'll go for a classic sweet tea. Okay, good. Here you go. What is your question? Where's the bleach? There it is. 
Where's the bleach? <laughs> Where's the bleach? She says. <laughs> oh, damn it, okay. Damn anyway, uh, my question is actually for you, Starline. What is your question? Oh, darn it. Okay. Uh, out of all the inventions, out of all the inventions you made so far, uh, which one would you say is your most favorite, and why? Oh, that's easy. My glove to control the warm topaz, and here's why. With it, I was able to create portals of any kind to anywhere my heart desires. It was help it's what helped me look for Eggman in the first place. Badniks are limited in their usefulness, and they can only be deployed in a limited range. I searched for much longer and in wider ranges than any bad army of badniks could traverse. And if I wanted to Very interesting. If I wanted to, I could also step through the portals. Though with a mortis charge I would do the windows of the world, so to speak, but then I would I would have to up the charge just a little bit and dissipate the other portals to go through the other one. Otherwise, I'll overload the glove and, of course, the warp tub has gone haywire. But, of course, Eggman didn't listen to me when I tried to warn him about it. And look what happened. Of course. So guess who was he right? He never listens. Mm -hmm. oh, thank you. He never does. Thank you for your question, Sega Gamer. This is a nice chat. You're welcome. And uh, before I go, I will actually tell you how I have my tea. You sh what we do is, instead of a kettle, we do do the stove, but instead of a kettle, we use a pot. Mm. That's ingenious. I, I like it. I'll, I'll allow it. I'll allow it. Yes. I mean, when in doubt, you have a pot. Yes. Exactly. Mm. Yes. All right. Well, thank you, Sega, G uh, Sega Gamer. You're welcome. See you around. <laughs> It's a chaos in the chat, dear lord. <laughs> okay, also, fish is banned from future of tea time panels. Uh, they just cross a they just cross a line. With what? What with do you chili? think with what? Oh the chili dog the yeah 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 yeah. <laughs> Oh, look, and now there's a rendition of me pouring bleach over my eyes. Accurate, accurate, accurate. Mm, that's perfect. Indeed. It's a work of art. I would put that oh. on my wall. Oh, why, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, but yes. Um, whose turn is it to pick a person? Um, uh, um, <laughs> oh, um, uh, um, uh, Whispering VA. Oh, right, she then. Oh my gosh. Mm. Fish is like, Gabby, I'm begging you, make Fish X Starline a thing. Oh boy. Uh, boy. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's bring up. Okay, for some reason, this profile picture kind of caught my eye, so I guess I'm going to stick with that. Hey, dear, no way. Well, let's bring up Peaches. Hey, yo. Peaches. Welcome Peaches. to the panel. Hi. Hey, hey, hey. So, um, my question is for Dr. Starline, and it's, um, what is your favorite thing about Surge? Like, just... My favorite thing about Surge? Ooh. Surge. Ooh. Yes, I, I know, I know. Good question. Good question, indeed. Okay. Um... I like that she's tenacious and knows how to do the job when she needs to. And I like okay. how she... Uh, see, that's the thing. I... I like, she... I, <laughs> you just hard. like how she, how she does her job. I just see the flaws. I'll be honest with you. It's hard to pick something good. I would say she, hmm. Well, she knows how to get the job done. Um, I like how she can take the lead when she needs to. And I also like her ingenuity. That's another fascinating feature. Okay. All right. That answered my well, question. Yes. What kind of tea would you like, Peaches? Oh, um, I don't actually like tea. <laughs> Oh, uh, that, 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 that's all right. That's all right. Yeah, I, I, I tried it and it just, I, it's not for me. 
All right. That's all right. Uh, well, thank you for stopping by anyway. Okay, thank you. That, that, asked, that answered my question. <laughs> all right. Have a good day. Bye. Bye-bye. See you around. Hey, guys. Uh, just as a note, if you're able to turn down any background noise when you're on the mic, that would be greatly appreciated. Uh, the TV was kind of distracting back there. It was a little distracting, yes. <laughs> anyway, I do believe it's my turn now. <laughs> You're like, Yes, go ahead and pick somebody, uh, Remix. Still at it. Are they still at it? Oh my goodness. Hey, boy. <laughs> oh. Uh, somebody shoot me. Pass, pass the gun. <laughs> uh, the shadow in here? We can borrow his. <laughs> Sincerely, Monarch. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> What do you mean? Oh no. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, can y'all hear me? Yep, I sure All right. can. All yep. right. What do you mean? Oh no, Starlight. Yeah, Starlight. You're with that mm. Lila. And um, normally you're chaotic together. Um, but do you microwave your tea or no? But no, actually, no, I don't. Come on, speak the truth. There's no judgment here. Uh, but would you want the, uh, would you want the honesty, like, for real, yes. for real? Yes, yes, give me the honesty. Honesty is a good policy. Uh, it just takes too long to boil. Yep, see, I knew it, I knew it, and I was kidding about the judgment thing, you're being judged right now. You've also been blacklisted from the uh, World Tea Association, that's right, you're on the list. What was your question? Oh. <laughs> no more tea for you, not unless you atone for your sins. Please ask, uh, at least ask me a question. Or oh, Sonic. <laughs> All right. Um, I guess this is generally to the both of you, but mostly to Starlight. Um, since Halloween is coming around the corner, any Halloween plans or evil Halloween plans to Starlight? I've been thinking. I want to try going as Tomaru Shigaraki from My Hair Academia. Mm. Solid choice. What about you, Sonic? What are you gonna go as? Um, what, dress up? Um, I don't know. Uh, mm. actually, dog costume. You know what? It has to be something that scares me. No, I can't just go as. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna go no, as... no, no, no. I'm gonna go as Amy. Oh. I will go dressed as Amy. I'll wear the dress. Uh, I'll dye my my quills pink. I was going to say no, no, go no. as go as a slim Eggman. That's scary. Nah, that's not scary. That's, all right, Amy in a bad mood. Then now that's scary. All right, I I I see your point. All right, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, there you go. Well, okay, thank um, you for the thank you for the answer, and I'll take some hibiscus tea. If oh, you don't. I said I, no. You have to atone for your sins first. What do I have to atone for? Uh, microwaving your tea. That's sure. what you must atone for. Okay, if I promise you not to microwave my tea, will you give me the hibiscus? Mm, come back next time and I'll, I'll consider it. Wow. I, I, I see how it is. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Well, thank you very much for uh, asking the question, Monarch. Yeah, 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 you're uh, Is there anybody in here that's sane? Who? Why would anyone microwave that tea? It takes too long to... Do, a minute and a half on the kettle, on high. It does not take long. It takes far longer than heating... It takes far longer to microwave your tea than it does um, boiling it in a kettle. People do it because they can see the time. You can't see the time on a kettle unless you time it yourself. But no one listens to me. Oh, no um, man, then, then you got those kettles that have the little hole that make the whistling noise. And then it once you hear that whistling, you know sound. it's you know it, it you know it's time for the delightful tea. I love it when I hear that whistle. Exactly. Excuse exactly. Me. All right. Uh, whose turn is it? Remix. Um. Uh, is it my turn? I don't know. Oh, I think whose turn is it? I've been so distracted and all over the place, I haven't really paid attention who called who up. Uh, who called up Monarch? I did, actually. Uh, it's my turn. Here's a name I haven't seen. Blue Country VA. <sighs> oh, hey, 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 y'all. What's going on? Hey, hey, hey. What's up? What kind of What's tea up? do you 
Oh, don't worry. I, 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 see, country boy, it's just the way I live. I brought my own. Arizona tea. That's what I brought. That's a brand, isn't it? Yes, it is, but it's oh, also my, tea. My <laughs> good sir, you are missing out. Well, you dang dumb. I can't, I, I, can't, I can't be like, one, you know, one of the, you know, those real classy people, you know? You can't take the country out of the boy, okay? You, you just can't do that. So just how about you, just some some sweet tea then, dude? That is a solid no, thing. You know what? You know what? You're you're right. You know what? I'll take a sweet tea. How about that? I've got you. I've got you. Evil all right. All right. All, that. Hmm. all right. Well, thank you. What is your I'm question? I'm South. I know. Uh, hey, yes. see, South people. We get it. And, yeah, and so does my mortal enemy. I'm going to find him and, and bomb him. Anyway, aside from that, what is your <laughs> what is your question? Yeah, besides all that, um, uh, this question's for Doc Starline. Mm-hmm. So, so uh, how did you cope with Eggman taking credit for your creation of the male virus and you know firing you and you just having male sock through throw you through a portal? And during that time, what did you do or what did you plot? Okay, first of all, I did not create the metal virus. Eggman had the concept before I did. I merely helped experiment with it. Mm. Secondly, when I was thrown out after being ridiculed and told that I was fired, I began to plot Mm -hmm. a way to show Eggman his failures. You see, he gets tunnel vision when it comes to Sonic. He thinks brute force is the answer to everything. I wanted to show him a clear concise and more level-headed way of thinking when it comes to Sonic. Uh, unfortunately, it didn't work in the end. Yeah. But oh well. Yeah, oh well. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you very much for the question. Of course. Y'all take care now. Peace. See ya. All right, Sonic, it's your turn. Ooh, let's go for... Hmm. Who have we not chosen? There's quite a few. I'm going to say... Prankster's already had a question once, so we'll, we'll get to them later. Yes, Prankster, wait your turn. Michael waving little... Let's go for Alice. Ah, Alice. Oh, hello. <laughs> ah, I recognize that voice. Hello. Hey. It's been like, uh, it's been like a while since I have been last called here. <laughs> Indeed. Um, what is, what kind of tea would you like? Like, I would like some, some cinnamon, cinnamon tea. Mm, very good choice. And, uh, all right. What is your question? Here you go. Thank you. So, like, uh, my first, okay, so, hold on. My question is, like, my question is, what, what is, what is, what is like your, what are your favorite desserts and why? Well, I already mentioned the, uh, the other milk, the, uh, Sunday I mentioned. Oh, you um, just made it worse. The Knickerbocker Glory. I mentioned the crumble. But, um, if I was just going to have something just off the cuff, just, I would want, um, just, a, a, I'm a, I'm a pie kind of person. Apple pie. Mm. It's very good. Sounds quite nice. It's a classic. Oh, mm. yeah. That's, yeah, that sounds delicious. <laughs> My grandmother had a recipe for apple pie that unfortunately has been lost to time. Quite a shame. Ooh. That, that's, that's quite sad. sad. Yeah, that is very sad. Mm-hmm. I, I right. did bring some I did bring some cookies for you guys. More biscuits. Hey. Yep, I'm, I'm, I'm still, I, I am still bringing cookies to the panels to, to this day. And we very much appreciate it. Thank you. All very right. Much it's All no right. problem. Thank you. Thank you very much, Alice, for your question and for the biscuits. You're, you're welcome. See you around. Right. Mm. See ya. Mm. Here's some good cookies. Mm. Oh, I'm telling you, Starline, sometimes managing uh, managing a convention can be so exhausting, even in the chat rooms and stuff. Listen, I don't know what's what's more tiring, uh, managing a convention or managing the heathens that keep microwaving their teas. Uh, yeah, and the chaos that ensues and the drama and uh, 
I know, just people don't understand. But anyways, um, who's there? Is it again? I think it's Whisperings, right? Ooh. I think so, yeah. I'm getting worn out. Uh, that makes two of yeah, us. Yeah, I'm really getting worn out. Mm. Here's a new you face. You people are going to be the death of me, I swear. Me. I mean, that's <laughs> usually how people die. All right, Wolf the Creator. Why don't you turn up up here? It went dark, man. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Gotta keep it light. Of course, of course. Hello, Wolf the Creator. No, hey, hey. Uh, sir, you forgot to unmute. Yeah. Hello. Oh, she, my bad. Ma'am. You need a microphone. Hello. Uh, oh, no. Might... Yeah. Oh, there we go. No, you unmute. Oh, no. Unmute. Yeah, unmute. No, please, no. I read the chat. Well, then why the heck did you come up here? Don't waste my time. Go back in the chat, please. Okay, I'll ask my question. All right, my then. Question. Nope, you've all, you have already wasted my time. I apologize. Type your chat. Type your question in the chat, please. Don't come up here muted and be like, "Oh, I just want to chat." Nope, I have very, very little tolerance for that. Thank you. And my patience has already been wed to the thin. And I'm sure the other co-hosts can agree with me on this. Yes. All right, let's try this so. again. Ah, uh, whispering. Pick another person. All right. Let's see. Here. Uh, Darkstar BA. Let's see if you have any questions that are not sick to the tea lovers. Mm, okay. All right, I'm here. Hello. 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 My question is to Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah? What, what is your opinion on the countless variants of violent black-eyed creatures of yourself, or as most would say, EXEs? Oh, <laughs> and here, 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 here we were saying to keep it light. Well, they're, you know, it's, it's a bit disturbing, I guess. It's a bit weird. Um, but that's, that's the, you know, the, the world we live in. You know, sometimes you get the those weird things that come out of nowhere. Oh, yeah. yeah understandable. Yeah, and, you know, I, I would say it's a bit weird, but... If people like it and they have fun, then have well, fun. So. That's where the statement, if you like it, I love it, comes into play. Yeah, exactly. Mm. What? I, I, that was my question. Thank you. Thank you no very problem. much. For... Would you like a tea before you head out? Oh, yeah, sure. Why not? What would you like? I like honey lavender. Oh, good choice. Good, good choice. Yes. Here you are, my good sir. Thank you, and I will be seeing myself out. Thank you for answering. No problem, thank you. Wow. You're in. He sounds really cool. I'll just say that much. Mm. I like his voice. Reminds me of that yeah, other fellow that you remind me of whispering. Yeah, you know what? He has, a, he has like, um, um, uh, was like a Dan Green vibe. Dan Green? I was thinking, oh, what's, what's that actor's name? Liam O'Brien. Oh! Him too? Liam. Yeah. Yes, that's what he reminds me of. Yeah. Yes. Anyways, uh, I believe it's my turn. I think uh, we'll take a... Uh, 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 oh, uh, of course. <laughs> of course, of course. I wasn't trying to... And actually, I want to read a text question off uh, from Wolf that when I asked the question. Of course. Uh, and then we'll take a few more after this, if that's all right. So Wolf asks, are you still connected with the villains? Are you still connected with the villains? Ooh, that's a good question. Uh, I mean, I mean, you considering been that every us. single, I mean, let's see. Um, Zavok still wants to kill me. Uh, the Skunk Brothers worship me like a god. I managed to convince them that I was some sort of deity. Don't ask me how. They're just that stupid. Mimic wants to kill me still. Um, I'm not really much into contact with Eggman. We don't really talk. That much anymore. Metal Sonic, there's no talking because he doesn't talk. Um, who has? I haven't spoken to Mephilus in a while. Infinite is a wall. Black Doom and I had tea the other day, but we just talked about other stuff. Not really. We were talking about our kids, to be honest. Um, and then, um, 
Yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm not really... We don't really talk. It's not like we can just go out in public and have coffee together or something. It, you know, we have to le- keep a low profile. <laughs> There's a lot of clandestine, you know, in the rain, under our light sort of thing. But... I mean, I mean to I, be fair, you have been helping us. Yeah, that's, that's fair. So maybe my reputation has tarnished as a villain. I guess. I don't know. We'll see. And yes, also, well, just, it's okay. You just, you know... You, uh, Starline just gets a little orny at times. Don't, don't worry about too much. Don't, you're okay. I, I know Wolf Wolf felt a little scared off, but that's okay. It, I was also very short on tempo. I apologize. You know. Uh, it, it, don't worry about Starline. It's normal. Thank we all, you, you know, I'm... everyone has those moments. It's just, you know, you get a bit stressed, you vent, and we move on. I'm so happy you all understand. Oh, yeah. You know, like I say, everyone deserves a second chance. Yep. Yeah. So, I guess I'll go ahead and pull somebody up now. Go ahead, please. We This would probably be our last one, too, because it's getting close to time here. Yes, yes. All right, all right. One more. Please, for the love of chaos, pick somebody decent. Who'd you pick? No, Fish, you're not getting back on here. Why are you even raising your hand? You Sit know. down. <laughs> Put your hand down. Sit down. Hello. 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 What kind of teeth do you oh. like? Uh, actually, I have some tea for you, my good sir. Oh, goody. What is it? Some Palestinian mint tea. Homegrown. Ooh. Just for you. Ooh. Well, this is such an extravagant... Uh, scrav- Sorry, my vocabulary <laughs> is kind of messed up from earlier. It's a great Take gift. Thank you. You're welcome. It's me, Khaled, the Batman without the bat, i.e. man. A fascinating introduction. What is your question, good sir? Yeah, I just want to ask you, like, okay, before I ask my question, can I tell you a funny, something funny that just happened? You must, no, you must uh, ask a question, please. All right. My question is, uh, are you excited for the Sonic Unleashed PC port coming in 2025? What? It got Sonic. Sonic Unleashed is coming to PC soon. Wait, wait, is Diet Dr. Kelp coming? Oh, I'll really? get running. Okay, um, well, I actually did not know about this. That's actually really uh, cool. I haven't heard anything. Well, if it's, got if it's true, if it's true, then I'm very excited for it. That will be a fun game to play. Um, yeah, I would, love, is, I would love you to know your source. Trusted, it is from a trusted source. It's well, from... Uh, even trusted. I can't tell you where, but uh, it's well, someone I know. Even, even uh, trusted trust me, bro, sources. Not good, not good enough, bro. Not good enough. No, no. The goods are not good enough. Um, but yes. Uh, we'll you gotta be able to name your source. Otherwise, we'll, you can't. We will keep our ears open. Uh, but yes, thank you for the question, Kyle. All right. All right. See ya. You round. Or... Yeah, sorry to be put a party pooper, but you gotta be able to name your source. Yeah. Uh, unless you're me, then the source is myself. Oh. Like, I could I could just go on the internet and say, hey, guess what? Eggman sucks. Source? Myself, because I freaking said it. <laughs> and it would be legit, because I said it. Uh, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, um, Starlight, I... Just get so exhausted sometimes just trying to manage everything. Oh, I know. On top of all of that. Uh, but, but, but that's okay. Uh, uh, why don't you take a, a break? I don't think I can really take a break right now. It's just like... Oh, it, 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 I, I think we all can agree that you've worked so hard this year, making this the best the best uh tenth anniversary you should take you should take a breather take maybe a month off or two or three i well i can't i mean we got we got the convention coming up in october and i still gotta run that remix remix you don't understand i insist boop wait what are you oh i'm so sorry uh Yes, and I am currently, uh, <laughs> I've not done this in so long. Hacking into systems. I've blocked every admin, every person off this thing. Perfect. I am now in complete control of this <laughs> revolution. 
Sonic, you shall serve as my enforcer. You shall make sure that none of your pesky friends interfere in my work until October. Do I make myself clear? Sure thing, Starline. Oh, no right, the other loose string. Sorry, whispering. <laughs> it's been fun playing with you, but I'm afraid the facade has to fade for now. Oh, don't, don't worry, Remix. Don't worry. I shall make sure this whole convention from now on, for the next ten or so years, go very, very well. And the spirit of Sonic is intact with my vision. <laughs> Come now, Sonic. Let's skedaddle before anything happens. If you will follow me. Sure. <laughs> sure will. Let's go. So, what's wrong with Sonic? It seems that Starline has put a mind manipulation device on Sonic. And I have no way to disable them. I need more time. Let's just smack down that platypus and make him take off the device. I knew that Starline was up to no good. He needs to be dealt with now. I had a feeling the lot of you wouldn't allow this takeover that easily. Which is why I came prepared to put down this revolution before you can try and stop me. Sonic? Sorry, guys. Can't let you spoil the party just yet. <laughs>